So this isn't just any i3, this is my personal i3. And today we're putting the genuine BMW Advance 3 Pro camera in this car. Join us here at the finish line with the i3, my i3, all complete with a dash cam. And you can see at the top there, nice little BMW crest on the front camera. So this is quite a simple installation. There's quite a lot to it. There's a few steps, but if you're a pretty good home mechanic, something you can do. This integrates not in the way that it would normally with some of the dash cams directly into the system, multimedia system, but it wires in into the BMW set up here so all the wiring comes through both front and the rear and works its way in and is fused here at the front of the car so if you follow me through here i can show you a little bit inside this car so you can see the dash cam if i open the suicide doors there you can see the dash cam at the front which is installed in the correct bmw position and this is a, a nice integrated part in the way that it fits beautifully at the front there and there's no exposed wiring it's just the one wire that goes into the roof lining and uh, looks pretty neat we actually did a full review video on this on our bmw m4 so if you guys want to see the video in action or the video in of these cameras in action then pop and see that video which we've already done there's a couple of videos it'll be interesting for you guys to see it this is the rear camera which you can see obviously as i pop it up just connected so this runs through the plastic trim here works down this section at the back um, and it works through the C pillar and then runs down the seat and then the flooring. So you actually don't need to drop the headline in for this part or for the installation for this particular car. So it runs from here down the underside and then as I said, comes into the fuse box at the front there. So it works very nicely and it's a very good fit. So no worries that it's a different fitment it is a bmw product so fitted really well as i said it can be done by home mechanics but you still need to have an idea of what you're doing hope you've enjoyed this video as i said if you want to know more about this dash cam we've done loads of video in with the video in of the camera display and some in-car driving as well so thanks for watching guys like and subscribe if you can and we'll see you guys next time Bye.